What's up, YouTube? Check this place out, man. I'm in Guantanamo Bay, Cuba. We're getting ready to go do a little dive, uh, snorkel along here. We're at a place called Girl Scout Beach. As you guys know, I work on a tugboat and do ocean towing. I've done that for almost 15 years now. So in this video, I'm gonna show you a little bit of the diving as well as some of the stuff we do and our voyage to get here and what everything is like. Check that out. Absolutely beautiful place. Hopefully you enjoyed that and I don't want you to think that this is some sort of uh, pleasure cruise because we don't always get time off to do stuff like that I think in six months we got one afternoon where we could get off the boat and do a little R&R uh, &R. but it was fun it's a beautiful place down here we are at the dock in Cuba and they're offloading the barge now but I thought I'd show you guys a little rundown of the tugboat you've seen yo MTV cribs this is gonna be yo MTV tugboat so what we got here I'm on the back deck you can see our tow wire here we're still connected up to the barge there those chains everything stays connected while we're down here till we leave and this is our towing winch, uh, double drum. This is, I think, two and a half inch wire, and that's what we tow the barge with. That's what we make the money with. Uh, we are equipped to tow two barges, but right now we just tow this one. Um, this right here is called the chafe board. We put that onto the wire here, and what that does is when the wire is on the stern, it doesn't chafe through and break. Very important. Anyways, let's go inside, see what's going on. Now, this is what's called the fiddly. That is Ben. That was Ben's butt. Uh, what's up, guys? He wasn't planning on that. We've got a motor that runs our winch 
and we come through here and we have the galley so you guys will see a little bit more of the galley later when I'm cooking a couple of portholes see where we're at when we're underway but uh, this is kind of where everybody hangs out underway and when we're not busy working which isn't often but you know all our meals are cooked here sometimes we hold meetings watch football games things like that this is a very very important part of any tugboat the coffee pot tugboats run on caffeine um, but we have two big freezers here so that we have plenty of food underway and we have a couple of refrigerators and plenty of counter space for the crew to all eat it's a five-man crew on this boat uh, come down here to the companion way we've got a nice size pantry on this boat all the things that you could ever want and we have crew rooms and we have a storage room and a crew head so we go up we have the captain's cabin and another uh, head for the mate and the captain I am the mate this is my room it's got everything you need and nothing that you don't a little fan got your life jacket you know it's small but uh like i said it works continuing on we have the wheelhouse so this is where i spend most of my time underway 12 hours a day i'll be up here i have the midnight to six watch and Captain Nick there has the 6 to 12. So we've got chart plotters and radars, backup chart plotters, VHF radios, compasses, autopilot, all the things that a boat would have. Stepping outside here, you can see our barge. The guys are working to offload it now. We have an assist boat that helps us out when we are docking and undocking. Bow the boat down there with an anchor windlass. Uh, but that's the gist of it. I didn't go in the engine room today because the guys are down there doing oil changes. And maybe in some later videos I can go more in depth on that stuff. But we're headed back to Jacksonville today. I'm hoping that we catch a fish, I'm hoping I can get it on camera for you guys, and then I'll cook it up for you. So, we'll see you underway. Fish on.
Jacksonville they're loading our barge right there uh, we're gonna get underway tonight right now tugs out doing some trials I've got a load of groceries that we need to get onto the tug get ready to go um, I'm gonna cook up that fish for you didn't have a chance uh, yesterday when we caught it but uh, Jacksonville is usually a really fast turnaround we'll be here less than 24 hours and we got to get grub, get fuel, get water. Uh, I'll get some shots of the tug coming back in. You'll see how much fuel is on board. Check it out. Some big ships down there. Those ships go to Puerto Rico. Dames Point Bridge in the background there. See in the galley. Chef Paul's blackening seasoning. 
we got here. guys a lot of people say cheese doesn't go on fish and I generally believe them for whatever reason this sandwich just works it's delicious you guys gotta try it and make your own tartar sauce it's absolutely worth it the stuff that comes in the jar is junk but I hope you guys enjoyed this tugboat video I'm gonna try to do more for you. Like I said, it's super hard to film because it's always very loud on the boats and we are actually working and I don't have time to just stop and film. Uh, if you've made it this far, please subscribe, follow, share, comment. You know, follow me on Instagram. I've got a TikTok, look me up. We'll see you on the next one.